If you're a Samsung fan and a good luck user, we've got some exciting updates for you. Samsung has announced that another module of the Good Lock app now supports One UI 7.0. Let's dive into the details and see what's new. If you're on the One UI 7.0 beta for the Galaxy S24, Galaxy S24 Plus, or Galaxy S24 Ultra, you'll soon be able to use the Notice Star module of Good Lock. The updated Notice Star version 7.0.15.0 is rolling out now in Korea and will gradually expand to other markets. You can download it from the Galaxy Store once it becomes available in your region. Now, while it's great to see Samsung adding One UI 7 support to more good lock modules, there are still a few gaps. For example, HomeUp, one of the most popular modules, isn't compatible with One UI 7 just yet. But don't worry. Samsung is expected to address this before the full One UI 7 rollout to all eligible Galaxy devices. Speaking of expansion, Samsung is also planning to make Good Lock available in even more countries. Plus, they're working on bringing it to the Google Play Store, which will make it much easier to download and use alongside the official One UI 7 release. Let's talk about One UI 7.0 itself. This is Samsung's first major update for Galaxy smartphones and tablets in 2025, and it's based on Android 15. While it's arriving a bit later than usual, Samsung promises it'll be worth the wait. One UI 7 is being called the biggest update since the launch of One UI 1.0, thanks to its major visual overhaul. The beta has been available since December 2024 for the Galaxy S24 series and will be preloaded on the upcoming Galaxy S25 series. So what do you think? Are you excited about One UI 7.0 and the updates to Good Lock? Let us know in the comments below. Today, we're diving into One UI 7, Samsung's latest update for its devices. While it's shaping up to be one of Samsung's most significant updates yet, with a fresh UI design, tons of new features, and better customization, there are still a few things missing. Let's talk about the top features One UI 7.0 didn't deliver and what we're hoping to see in future updates. 1. Simple App Lock Let's start with app security. Samsung's secure folder is fantastic for creating a secure, separate environment, but it can feel excessive if you just want to lock a single app. Rumors suggested that One UI 7.0 would introduce a simpler app lock feature, but sadly, it didn't happen. A quick, easy-to-access app lock would be a game-changer for many users. Here's hoping Samsung delivers this in One UI 7.1. 2. Better Icon Shape Customization Samsung offers plenty of customization options, but changing the shape of app icons remains a hassle. While tools like Theme Park, part of Good Lock, allow for some tweaks, the results aren't always perfect. Think uneven white space or clipped edges. Other brands like Google, OnePlus, and Xiaomi have nailed this feature, and it's time for Samsung to simplify the process. A smoother, more intuitive solution would go a long way in making devices feel truly personalized. 3. Samsung Keyboard Needs an Upgrade The Samsung Keyboard gets the job done, but it still lags behind Google's board in terms of typing accuracy, swipe functionality, and predictive text. While Samsung Keyboard offers some great features, many users are left wishing for board-level performance. Unfortunately, One UI 7.0 didn't bring any major improvements here. Enhancing the keyboard's predictions and overall typing experience would make the huge difference. 4. Better Battery Health Insights Battery health is a hot topic, and detailed battery metrics are becoming the norm on many devices. With Android 14, some manufacturers now offer detailed data like charge cycle counts, manufacturing date, and remaining capacity percentage. Samsung, however, still provides basic good or bad battery health info. With Apple, Google, and others leading the way, it's surprising that Samsung hasn't followed suit. Adding this feature in future updates would be a welcome improvement. These missing features might not be deal breakers, but they're definitely areas where Samsung could improve to make One UI 7 even better. Whether it's app lock, keyboard improvements, or detailed battery metrics, there's room for growth. What do you think? Are these features you'd like to see in a future update like One UI 7.1? Or are there other features you feel are missing? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.